Today's video is just a quick one to look at the pros and cons of biofuels. When we say biofuel, all we mean is a fuel that's made from recently living organisms. The fact that they were recently living is an important distinction because fossil fuels are also made from living organisms. It's just that those organisms lived millions of years ago and were converted to fuel by a very different process. Biofuels generally come from plants or algae because these organisms can photosynthesize and so they can lock up the sun's energy, which can then be released later when we burn them for fuels. We can also use animal waste, but this is often done at a much smaller scale. Although burning biofuels releases carbon dioxide, we normally think of biofuels as being carbon neutral because they took up that carbon dioxide while they were growing so there's no overall release of CO2. Because we can grow biofuels over and over again, they're effectively a renewable resource, and they're also relatively cheap to make. Another benefit is that they're easy to transport, and we can mix them with fossil fuels like petrol. This means that we can benefit from biofuels without having to get new cars, like we would if we wanted to use the electricity generated by solar or wind. The issue though is that in reality it's not quite that simple. For one, we need somewhere to grow all of these plants, and generally that means converting natural land, which could involve things like cutting down forests. This means that even before we get the first crop of biofuels, we've already damaged the environment, and potentially burned down loads of trees, releasing tons of CO2. Another problem is that the harvesting of the plants, processing, and then transport of all the fuels all require energy, which probably means more CO2 being released. Overall, it's hard to tell how good biofuels really are. They're definitely not as good as we first thought, but when used properly, they can be a great substitute for fossil fuels. And as with all renewable energy resources, it's not all or nothing. We can choose to use biofuels where it does make sense and use something else where it doesn't. Anyway, that's it for this video, so hope you found it useful, and I'll see you soon.